Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be sharing with y'all my favorite pairs of blue denim shorts. And I've got six pairs here that I want to share with you. Some are oldies that I've worn year after year, and then some are relatively new that I've added to my wardrobe this season, and they've immediately become some of my favorites. So I'm really excited to show you guys all of my favorite shorts. I am five foot two just for reference, so I am a little bit on the shorter side. If you're new to my channel so keep that in mind with the length but I think you guys are gonna really like these options and hopefully it'll just give you an idea if there's something that you want to add to your wardrobe so I'll have everything linked down below in the description box as well as the size that I'm wearing but let's go ahead and get into the try on I am going to just insert a little clip of me wearing the shorts so you guys can see what it looks like on while I talk about them first pair is from Abercrombie and if you guys have been with my channel for the last, I guess, year, year and a half, kind of, I have been kind of obsessed with Abercrombie, for being honest. I had so much hesitation around the brand, obviously, like, grew up with it in high school, and it has made a comeback, and we all know it, and so I had to, of course, grab a pair of these last year. I got these last summer. These are the cut-off high-rise short. I'll be sure to link them down below, like I said. These are a really great pair of shorts. I like these because they have the really great distressing. They're the perfect blue denim wash. And what's really nice about these is that they're high rise, but if you have a shorter torso or you're shorter or more on the petite side, they don't go too high, which some shorts can go too high. Some people like them to go all the way up to the ribs. Some people don't. So this is definitely a video on preference, but these ones are a really great rise and I love the way that these look on my body. I think they are just really flattering on. One thing about these, that these are probably the shortest shorts that I will be showing you guys. I have a lot of really great shorts for those of y'all who are a little bit more like me and just don't want to show their booty off. I actually don't feel uncomfortable with these ones on like at all, but I probably would not go shorter than these. So this is probably where my comfort level kind of ends, but I kind of love that longer shorts and like baggier shorts are kind of in right now. I feel like that already kind of melds with my, melds? Is melds a word? It's melds, right? Oh gosh. Abercrombie has so many different shorts on their website. And I know they have a Curve Love line as well, which one of my friends gets the Curve Love and she swears by it and they look really good on her. So I love that they have different options for different body types, but these ones are really cute, a really just great basic denim short option. I feel like all of these are gonna be great basic denim shorts, but they're all different, I swear. <laughs> Next up is a pair from Madewell and I actually just got these during the spring and I. I love these. I think these are really different than any other pair of denim shorts that I have. These ones are almost a little bit more dressy because they're not distressed anywhere and they have a really beautiful pocket here on the side. I just love the fit of these. I feel like these have a very A-line fit to them. And these ones are super high-waisted. They do rise a little bit higher than the Abercrombie shorts, but they're really soft denim. It feels like they're already broken in, so they're really, really comfortable. And I'd never feel like when I wear these that I'm like getting chopped in half. They are extremely comfortable and just very like, not stretchy, but there's some give to the denim. Some of these shorts have no give. I would say these Abercrombie ones that I just showed you guys don't really have a lot of give. These ones are just really, really soft. I also love the back of them because they have this really cool stitching right through the pocket. So that's a fun detail. And these little back pockets are just adorable. So these shorts definitely feel a little bit more dressy to me. I love the length of these as well. I think they're very comfortable length, especially because they are a little bit of a nicer denim short. Since they're longer, I feel like you can wear them out and feel very comfortable in them. Um, what do we want to do? Next up is my current favorite favorite pair of denim shorts. And I have been eyeing this brand for a long time. It's the Agoldi 
denim shorts and I think I'm saying that right. I looked up this brand on YouTube and every single review said this brand's name differently. I've heard a Goldie, I've heard a Goldie, I've heard a Goldie. I don't know. I'm going with a Goldie. These are the D shorts and I'm obsessed with these. I've told all my friends about them. I will warn you guys, these are a higher price point than the rest of the shorts that I'm gonna show you guys, but I love them. I tried them on in Aritzia and I was like, I'm gonna splurge and get these because they just fit so well. They were so comfy and flattering on and it was like one of those moments where I like, tried it on and I was like, I could, I could walk away, but I'm gonna still think about them. So I decided to just get them and I'm so happy I did because I've worn them so much. I love the blue wash. These D shorts come in a bunch of different washes so you can get the one that you want. They're some that are more distressed, less distressed. I got the less distressed version. There are some with like rips in the actual short, but I love these because they have this little slit on the side. And I actually saw some reviews on these before I even tried them on in the store because I was so interested in the brand. And there's some people who don't like the slit. I personally like the slit because I think it makes it more comfortable when you're sitting down. And then also, I don't know, it makes your legs look longer from the side a little bit. So I'm obsessed with these. If you guys cannot tell, I'm so glad I bought these. These have a button fly, which is probably the only thing that I'm kind of like, ugh, I kind of wish it didn't have a button fly. I personally don't love a button fly just because I feel like it makes the like front of the shorts a little bit more bulky, but the fit is so good. I was like, you know what? The button fly is fine. We'll take it. So if I could like design these exact shorts with a zipper fly, I would buy a hundred pairs and wear them for the rest of my life because those would be perfect. Button fly aside, they are probably the most flattering shorts that I have, if we're being totally honest. These ones are really high rise, super, super high rise. So if you don't like them to hit your ribs, these are gonna be probably too high for you. I don't mind them hitting my ribs because I just think they look so good on. Yeah, they're just really cute and I love them. And I definitely am so glad I got them. I have worn them to do yard work in, which is why I have this stain here on the front that I need to wash out. I need to wash these, but they're just incredible. and. And I honestly will probably purchase another pair from a Goldie because they are so stinking flattering. I love the length. The length is so good. Even if you're taller, I've seen taller people wear this D short. Looks so good. If you're short like me, looks so good. These are probably my top recommendation. If you've never tried this brand, I would highly recommend. So these are my faves. You can't tell I'm very, very hype about these because these are new to my wardrobe and I don't know why it took me so long to buy these because they're amazing. Next up is a tried and true pair. I have worn these for years, maybe three years, four years, three years, maybe four years, somewhere around there. The perfect jean short. These are from Madewell and these are so flattering. They are high-waisted but they do not go up to your rib cage. So again, if you're on the shorter side and you don't like shorts to hit your rib cage, these are the perfect rise. They're also a really great length if you're shorter. They're not a long short. I know the long short trend is on. I'm actually gonna show you a pair of longer shorts that I like, but these ones, if you're not into the long short at all, are the perfect length. I would say they're kind of around that same length as the Abercrombie shorts and these ones though are more stretchy than the Abercrombie shorts, so these ones are really comfy. The Abercrombie shorts are like comfortable, but they're more rigid. These ones have a little bit more stretch. They just feel a little bit more like broken in. They honestly just fit like the perfect vintage jeans, but they're in a short version. They come in so many different washes. You can get them, I believe in like black denim, white denim, lighter blue denim, this color. So if you're looking for just a really great pair and you already know you like the Madewell fit, definitely would recommend these. I think these are so flattering on somebody who is a little bit shorter because of the length. Yeah, I've had these forever and I just always go back to them because they are really, really good and they're just really flattering on. Next up are a pair of shorts that are gonna shock you guys. These ones are from 
Walmart and they are an incredible price. So one, if you're looking for a more affordable short to add to your wardrobe, these ones are a longer denim short vibe. And these are great if you wanna try the longer denim short because they are more affordable. You don't have to commit to buying like the Agoldi longer denim shorts. You can start out with these. I love these because they are so comfortable. These are like right between a mid and high rise. So they are high rise, but they cut just like slightly lower than, well, they go above your hips, but they're not like rib cage at all. They are really, really comfortable on. And I love these because they have the cuff at the bottom and the cuff is not like tight around your legs. I have a pair of shorts from Madewell that have a cuff around the bottom and they are like, kind of tight on my thighs and I don't like the way that that looks because I feel like it just kind of constricts which is why I like a lot of A-line style shorts. These ones though are more relaxed fitting and I love the way that they look. They're just so cute with a tank and they are just... Like I said, they're so comfortable and they don't constrain your legs or anything like that. So these really surprised me. I would highly recommend them if you're wanting to try a longer short that is super comfy. Last pair of shorts are a new pair from Madewell. I got these this year. I would highly recommend sizing down one to maybe two sizes in these. I think they just run a little bit big, but these ones are, what are these even called? the mom jean short these ones are so comfortable guys they feel like a sweat short it feels like they have been worn for years and years and years they are the softest denim very flexible you can definitely like sit cross-legged like you can do anything in these because they're just so stretchy and comfy that's why i would recommend sizing down though because they are like such a stretchy material i don't know i personally like a lot of my shorts more fitted at least in like the waist and the booty area the thighs i, I don't want them to be fitted these ones are really really high waisted so these ones go up to your rib cage so if you don't like that fit again i would pass on these but they are literally so comfy that even though they go up to your rib cage you don't feel like you're being cut in half they are have i said they're comfy yet they're so comfortable and i just love the distressing they're really flattering on the booty area and they are just a really really cute option again if you like that longer short that isn't a long short trend you know what i'm saying like mid thigh but they're more modest and just more coverage so this is my last and final pair that i would recommend have been loving these but those are my top shorts for spring and summer i hope this video was helpful if you liked it be sure to leave me a comment down below let me know what your favorite shorts are for spring and summer i'm always down to try new brands and i would love to know if you've tried a goldie before i keep saying that brand because i think i'm in love with this brand i might be if you like this video be sure to give it a thumbs up leave me a comment down below don't forget to subscribe if you're new here and you want to stick around for some more videos i would love to have you back on my channel and i'll see you guys in my next one really really soon bye y'all